Is this just decoration? It's kind of crazy. Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome to The Shivers. This is a brand new ghost hunting game from the developers who also made Haunt Chasers, which is a very fun multiplayer horror game. Now that's not, that's not necessarily a ghost hunting game, and they actually stopped development temporarily on Haunt Chaser because they weren't like, uh, not enough people were buying and playing the game, and they decided that their skills would have been better suited for something like a ghost hunting game. And also with the success of Phasmo, they were like, maybe we can dip our toes into the ghost hunting genre and make a much more successful game. Now I've looked at this game a little bit and I've checked out some of the tools and it looks really cool. Like it looks like they're trying to do something different with way cra like crazy tools there's uh, a whole bunch of stuff here to look at uh, the game is coming out soon so i don't know when exactly that is but i hope it'll be soon because i cannot wait to see all the uh, all this stuff because i really like haunt chaser so i cannot wait to see another game from the same developers and we're just going to check it all out today and i hope you join us for that if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you just like it, like it but let's not waste any more time and let's look at this guy who is probably me <laughs> hi there uh, you can customize your character oh boy i should probably put on some clothes maybe can we put on some uh, wait, how do you do this? Uh, jacket? Oh, baby. Uh, there is... Oh, man. I'm fancy. I'm fancy as heck. Let's put that one on. I would like... To, yeah, there we go. Hood... Hoodie? Hoodie? <laughs> okay, let me, uh, put that on. Can I put some pants on? Put some suit pants. Dude, I'm gonna be fancy as all get out. Uh, could we put some hair? Do we have hair? Aviator glasses. Dude, look at this guy. This guy is Hitman. Uh, I would, yeah, pretty, maybe wear some sneakers or some, uh, dress shoes. Look at that guy. That's me. Save. <laughs> That's a fancy dude. Okay, so I have zero dollars, nothing. Uh, multiplayer? Okay, multiplayer is required. Let's go over here. We gotta get a single player, obviously. Uh, I don't know if the multiplayer works already, because I'm pl currently playing, um, like, the, the early access version. Uh, we're gonna go in, I guess, on easy. What do we have? We have EMF, ESG... A flashlight, an easel canvas, an ecto glass, a spirit box, and a UV light. Okay, none of that makes means anything to me. Let me quickly see. Is there a tutorial around here? Oh my god, there's so much stuff. Uh, this one in particular. Look at that one. There's a cockroach on it and a bunch of watches. What the heck is that tool? There's so many weird tools. They got obviously crucifix, obviously photo cam. Looks like a very cool game. Very uh pretty as well all right let's just head in i guess we'll see what we we will we'll see what we find in there start oh there okay so i have no idea what i'm doing we'll see how this goes this is my sanity screen i'm guessing uh i am oh look at that i am sane hopefully uh, a watchable camera source is not available because we don't have a camera place yet Metaphysical intelligence pre-report. Detect a type of the ghost. Use your tools to detect a type of the ghost and open your tablet to select the ghost type. Optional objectives will be unlocked after everyone on your team has chosen the ghost. Interesting. Even if someone is next to you, it will respond. Keon Riddle? Keon? Keon Riddle. Case 5,273 Jeebus. Okay. Uh, is that a sight from inside the house? Because that looks kind of creepy. Okay, where are my tools? We got a flashlight. We'd like to have that. Nice. Thank you. Uh, then we got the cockroach machine. What is this? What is this cockroach machine? <laughs> that is so weird. Oh, when I move around, the cockroach moves. I want to use that. Is that an EMF? <laughs> what the hell? Uh, and then we got this thing. We got a spirit box. Can I pick up something else? Uh, hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Oh. The heck? Oh, baby. This game looks sick. I because Han Chaser looked amazing too, so I'm, I'm expecting great graphics here. Uh, there's a skull right there. Is that gonna show up on the on the cockroach radar? I'm just gonna walk in here. V is to push to talk. Hello, wait. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? It seems like it's going up a little bit. Not much though. Can I quickly check the settings? Uh, controls. Push to talk. Here we go. Push to talk. That. Hello, hello. We'll see about that. We'll see how if it's gonna listen to me. There's a... Oh, fine. Good here. Hello? This house is looking mighty spooky. Mighty spooky house. Nice, we got light sources. Hello there. There's a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, the roach is doing nothing right now. I don't even know what I'm holding. Like, is this a some makeshift EMF sensor that I have? I don't know, man. Uh, where are you? Can you hear me? 
Uh, hello, can you hear me? Oh, we got some stuff. Oh, I gotta hold like that. Where are you? Can you hear me? I'm just gonna look around to see if anything's gonna happen. This is definitely one abandoned house, I can tell you that much. Uh, oh boy. Great atmosphere. Oh. Hello? It, it was... Talking to me? It's talking to me. What the fuck? Did this just move? Excuse me, it's just stop? Okay. We got... Oh, yes, it's responding. Okay. We got a spirit box response. There's so many damn ghosts. Holy shit. What the fuck? Wait, where'd the chair go? The chair's moving. Okay. EMF? Is this EMF? Stuff is rotating. There's so much stuff happening. Okay, EMF three. The heck? That's cool. Okay, I'm gonna leave this on the ground. Uh, I'm gonna leave this on the ground because obviously we got that and I'm gonna get the hell out of here to try and get another tool. Okay, okay. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, the number changes. Uh, oh. okay, go, go, go. We need to grab some more stuff. It seems like there's lots of interactions the ghost can do. Why is there a cockroach on the EMF reader? I have no idea. Is that a UV light? That's gotta be a UV light, right? So what kind of evidence do we got? We had EMF level 5, fingerprints, easel canvas drawing, freezing temperatures, ESG ghost interaction? What is... Whatever that means. Uh, is this an ESG? This might be the ESG. And then... I guess we can put this thing... This is a UV light, right? Okay, we'll bring in the UV light as well. It's got exposed batteries. Probably not a good idea. <laughs> maybe the roach detects the signals? I don't know, maybe... That what what the idea is? Is that based on any lore of ghost hunting? I have no idea. Yeah. Okay. We're here. Luckily, we found the ghost right away. This is not here anymore. Seems to be kind of peaceful here. What's this picture? That's a picture. That's not a video. Can't lie to me. Turn on some lights so we can actually see. Oh. What is this thing? There's like some current going between is this like a motion detector do i gotta place this there's no way up it's like it's oh hello there <laughs> why you spooky piece of garbage so if if han chaser is anything to go off of on chaser is like a it has some of the like the jump scares in that game will destroy you when you play it the first time it's a very interesting game i'm gonna place it right here oh wait a minute maybe i gotta place it it's doing something, that's for sure. Oh, here we go. Threw this on the ground. EMF3? What is this supposed to do? I don't know, man. This is so weird, doing playing a ghost hunting game and having no clue what any of the tools do, dude. Yeah, they got self-made assets and stuff. I mean, they did that for Haunt Chaser, too. I don't know, it's doing something. Maybe that's an interaction, who knows. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this here so we can take all the tools in. Because uh, I'm guessing it's going to be like three evidence. Yeah. Uh, they, Gorio, Ahiran, Ahriman. Oh, God. Hello? Oh, fuck. I'm going to leave real quick. I don't like it here. Go, go, go. Grab the rest of the tools. It's a poltergeist? Potentially. There's a poltergeist as an option, right? Yes. Dio? Moroi Haunter. I know all these ghosts. except It's literally... Okay, that's a little... <laughs> That's a little stupid. You could oh no, never mind. This goes back here. Uh Abaddon Ari the oh this is all Phasma ghosts and then two extra ghosts. Ari Man Abaddon. I guess they just looked up as many ghost things as they could. I don't know anything about ghost lore, so I don't know how many different spirits there are. Also there's upside down bone crucifixes. That seems like a bad idea. There's a face on the background. Oh there is! What the fuck? <laughs> I didn't even see that. Okay, grab this. And grab this. All right, that's everything we have, like until now. Oh wait, look at this. I can see through it. What the heck? Are we gonna see the ghost? Okay, that's interesting. Hello there. I hear the, the crucifix thing, or the the cockroach thing. Oh, any ghost? I see nothing. It's like some weird ghost orb detector. Okay, let's uh, place this, obviously. Just, could I rotate it? I can rotate it. Okay, maybe the ghost will interact with that. 
Now we are gonna obviously have our flashlight. Is the ghost gonna hunt at some point? I should have checked the sanity reader. Um. Hello? How are you doing? I don't know. I'm trying to find orbs or something, but I don't see anything. I don't think it's freezing, right? Freezing would have been obvious. So we're gonna rule out freezing. I'm gonna pick up this and maybe walk past some doors. Is this door... I did not open this door. Oh, God, there's the basement. Fuck you. All right, here we go. Hello? Oh. Wait, it lit up. Is that a thing? What is this called? Is this an ESG? Wait. Is... Me? Hello? Is that a hiding spot? No. Anyone here? What the hell is that? <laughs> is that drawing? What the fuck? That's a fucked up statue. Oh god, it's a freaking naked guy. Don't look, YouTube. I hear breathing. I don't know what this. Oh, what the fuck? I don't know what this means. It's like a white dot on my thing. Hello? It, so the game has voice recognition. It can't hear you. I'm just holding down push to talk to see if I can make it angry. I'm not seeing anything on this. Wait, did it close the door? Is that how I came in here? No, it's a new place. Oh, there's a creepy face on that. Never mind. Do you want to pray with me? Play with me. Sorry, I'm stupid. Oh. Do I? I don't think I do. Oh god. Uh, what's this? So, in Haunches, you have to solve a bunch of puzzles. What the fuck? There's a finger in there, by the way. Oh. This. Is this just decoration? It's kind of crazy. <gasps> what the fuck? Oh my god! Excuse me! Jesus Christmas, what was that? What the hell? <laughs> Red Witch, thank you for the five gifts of Simplabas says thank you for the $25 donation. What the heck was that? Good sir. That scared the living shit out of me. <laughs> what the fuck? I was not expecting that at all. Oh my god. Okay then, okay then. This game's not messing around. They got jump scared. Oh god. Well, okay, that is more good. I don't want to be there anyway. Goodbye. Uh, maybe in here? What the hell? <laughs> oh! What? What was that? Was that a, a hand spider? Excuse me. You look like some fucked up AI generated art. Oh, I know that lady. I know that guy. Those paintings I've seen before. What the heck? Okay, that's not... That's, that's, that's not good. There's a there's candles here as if it's some kind of crucifix, some summoning ritual, whatever. Uh okay. I'm just gonna walk back here. I don't know what I'm looking for really, but this is kind of sick. Oh, come on, stop breaking the lights. These pictures are fucked. Okay, how are my tools doing? Did it write anything on the easel? It didn't, but it is doing stuff here. Threw something over here, right? I heard that. Well, there. So it's definitely not EMF, right? If this is an EMF, which I'm assuming it is, I'm gonna say it's not EMF five. So I'm gonna rule out EMF level five. Uh, what is this thing? If I put this outside, is it still gonna rotate? Oh god. That. Let's bring this shit outside, because if if the rotating is an interaction, then like. Okay, it's just what it does. Okay. I don't know how the fuck... Yeah, let's check my sanity real quick. Am I about to go crazy? Also, what is this called? I don't even know what this is called. <laughs> okay, sanity. My sanity is at 58%. I am going to die. I am going to perish. Okay, we need to select one and then I get optional objective. Have the ghost blow out the candle? Find sitting human silhouette using the ectoplasm glass... 
Take a solid photo of the ghost. Excuse me. <laughs> that is interesting optional objectives, honestly. Hold left click. Oh, you're smart. I'm stupid. Of course. I mean, I could see through it before, but now I can see through it better. You have to place it on the ground and wait for the ghost to have an interaction with it. Okay. Well, it's active here nonstop, so we're placing it. It's not writing in this either. I think there's no easel. No easel? Spear box we definitely had. Um. Hello? Give me a three. That's, I like that. I like. Excuse me. <laughs> That's cursed ship behind there. Okay, it's definitely not EMF, as we can obviously tell. Um, oh, I'm about to die, man. Could... <laughs> what? Oh. I don't know. Is it gonna leave fingerprints anywhere? What am I looking for? Fingerprints. I don't see any fingerprints. The roach is dancing. I know. There's no writing on that either. I think we... I mean, this is obviously where the ghost is. Unless there's, like, multiple ghosts or... They're everywhere. This... Is this called the ESG? It does mostly on doors. I see... It seems like people have been playing this game. Like, it just... And I haven't really followed this game. It just kind of dropped. I was like, wait a minute. I know those devs. Those devs have made the Han Chaser. And then I played it. Ectoplasm? I don't... That's ectoplasm glass? Okay. Oh. It closed the door just now. Okay, check for fingerprints. Unless I closed it. I don't see fingerprints. But why does it go... Why does it turn on when I go down here? Is that supposed to mean anything? When I go down into the basement, the light on the thing, the machine turns on? Is that an interaction? Or is that... Oh, wait, there's a door here. I didn't even see that. What kind of thing? Ectoplasm on that door? Wait, are you kidding me? There was ectoplasm? Execute. Thank you for the prime. And the link. Thank you for the nine months. I don't see it at all. Maybe it's gone already? Ectoplasm on the wall next to the door. That's nothing. Use the glass? Oh, sorry. What the fuck? The glass is for ectoplasm. Okay. It's gone now. Oh, the fire doesn't show up in the lens. <laughs> Magic. It's all good. This is cool, though. I love figuring out shit. Like... Playing these games for the first time and just not knowing anything is... I don't know, this is really fun to me. This makes them extra scary. Okay. Oh, something's happening over there. Ooh. What the fuck? Oh, uh, hello? That's cool. Wait, so items can turn into monsters. <laughs> is that gonna give me a big interaction? Oh, EMF 4! I guess just because of ghost interaction? Okay. Um... Uh, is this the ghost event? It was just a ghost event, guys. It's all good. Fire. Hi there. Hi there. Hi there, my friend. You've got a fucked up face. Do you die when you touch him? I don't think so. The chair is pushing me. Is there going to be ectoplasm on this? Can you move the chair? Thank you. And I need to check. Oh, I'm fucked. I don't... I didn't know this. Oh, there's ectoplasm. Look at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That is hard to see. Okay, so it's white. It's on the wall right there. You see it? We found it. Ectoplasm. Ectopl- Is it- That's ectoplasm stain. It's a shade or a spirit. Are you kidding me? So it's either ESG ghost interaction or- oh, oh no. Oh no. Am I dead? I can't escape. Oh god. 
Fine. I can't open this door though, that's bad. Oh. Ah! <gasps> what the hell, brother? My brother in Christ, Jesus. What the fuck? Help, help, help. Help, I should probably not go into the basement. Seems like a terrible idea. Dad came out of nowhere, scared the shit out of me. Run. Holy fuck, am I okay? What'd she ever do to you? <laughs> this is very... This is like Han Chaser plus Phasmo equals this game. Because these type of jump scares are very much like Han Chaser. That's cool. Okay. I mean, I guess we're safe now. What the fuck was that? Was that a hunt? I'm guessing it was a hunt. So... I feel like if I had to choose, it's probably this device. What the fuck? It's probably this thing. Because I don't know what the hell... Unless it's one of the... Oh, it could be freezing temps. Wouldn't you see the freezing temps? What the fuck are all these models? Oh god, oh god, it's something again, it's something again. Help me. Oh, it's coming. He's, he's showing up right there. Ah! What the fuck? Run! Run, 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 I'm dead, I'm dead as hell, I'm dead as hell, I'm dead as hell, I'm dead as hell. Run far away from him. Oh boy. What the fuck? I'm I'm running into a dead end. What am I doing? What have I done? Jesus Christmas. Okay. Um I'm gonna say it's a uh, easel drawing and it's a shade. Once you've converted you cannot undo this action. Fuck, do we know? Because I I don't think if there was easel drawing it would have happened already unless it disappears. Unless it disappears after a while, I feel like the easel- Because what else can you do besides just place this in the ghost room? Which has been here this whole time. So I'm gonna say it's probably the ESG. I can't leave? I can't leave anymore? I can't leave anymore. I'm fucked. I'm gonna die! What the hell? What the fuck are you? Excuse me! It's everywhere! Help. 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 What the hecky decky? Can I please get out now? Oh, I can't. Okay, go, 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 go. Jesus Christ. Okay. I don't know what the hell just happened, but I looped it or something. Oh, my mic is always open, so be careful. Uh-oh. Okay, anyway. So, um, it's probably... So, fingerprints be... That, that doesn't matter. So, if it is... Because fingerprints, it can't be... EMF 5 it can't be. So it's either one of these. Well, we didn't see any freezing temps. And then it's either ESG ghost interaction, which is that weird device we put on the ground, or uh, an easel canvas drawing. Now, the drawing hasn't happened at all. So I'm going to say it's probably the ESG ghost interaction uh, because the, the canvas drawing would have stuck around, right? We would have seen that. So let's go with spirit. And then we're going to say yes, confirm. Uh, did I get it? Find it, ghost. <laughs> ghost selection confirmed. Optional objective will be unlocked after everyone has chosen the ghost. Found ghost, spirit. Instant selection, spirit. So everyone has to agree. Now what do I do? Do I get new items? Do I get new items that I can use for the side objectives or what? What is happening? Uh, oh, here we go. How do I do this? You can complete these objectives and earn more rewards. Or you can get in your car and return to your safe house. Without complete- I don't have them, right? Because I don't have these items yet. Exorcism will not be unlocked until you complete all the optional objectives. Very cool. So I don't think we can do this because we don't have a candle. We don't have... We have the ectoplasm glass. But we can't do all of these objectives. We can't do a photo of the ghost. So I think we should just go out of here and then get some items so we can then do like a proper investigation. Also, how the fuck do I leave? Oh, there we go. Uh, so how do I get out of here? We we'll just go to the car and then say bye-bye. Wait, this is like the <laughs> metaphysical. <laughs> Wait, is, is it trying to do a metaphysical spin as well? Excuse me, or uh, not metaphysical, but uh, supernatural. <laughs> did we do it? We did it, got the ghost type. We got a thousand for that? Oh my God, we did it. We got the ghost on our first try. Let's do it. Oh, baby. Let's go. Okay. And then uh, can I buy stuff? Uh, Back. Yes, we got a thousand. Now, how do I buy stuff? I would like to... I can't go main... Oh, I click main menu. Now I'm going to be waiting here. No? Oh, here. Mon money. 
Uh, we would like to have a candle. Wait, it's already a fully fleshed game? Why is this a demo? I didn't pay a single dollar for this, by the way. What the hell? I don't understand. How is this game free? Uh, this is $9,600. Are you kidding me? Okay, sanity pills. Um, what do we do? UV light, all of this stuff we already got. I think I'm going to take a photo camera. Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> I can't. Let's just do a candle then. Buy a candle. Yes. Do we need to buy a lighter as well, or can I just turn it on? Okay, there we go. Uh, I think we're going to just, we're going to go in with that. So we now can do one more objective. Uh, let's go. That was actually really effective. Do I put it in? How do I put it in? Did I not buy it? It, it should, I did buy it. Why can't I put it in? Custom my safe house? Wait, that's so cool. It includes many types of music to cheer things up a bit. Wait, you can buy stuff? You can have a cat? You can have a cat? <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Well, I guess I already bought this now because I can't buy it again. I have... Yes, I have one. So do I put it in? Oh, I can put it in. There you go. I'll put in the candle. And these are... Yeah, there you go. So we put in the candle. These are all default tools. Okay, cool. Let's go in again. Uh, we got to select the map first. As, as of now, there's only one house, but as you can see in the full game, there's going to be three houses. Uh, so let's go. I I'm still going to do easy because I don't want to die. Because <laughs> you can just try out this game for completely free. This is zero dollars. Uh, Celesti Bates. It only answers when you are alone. Okay, <laughs> that's very much like Phasmo. Uh, wait, it does say metaphysical. Metaphysical intelligence pre-report. What does it say? Yeah, we just have to detect the uh, detect the ghost. Okay, so let's go in again with obviously flashlight and then this. You have to. F Hopefully, the ghost is going to be in a similar location, like before. Let's go. This thing seemed incredibly useful to find the ghost. It's cool though. There's, there's so many different ghost interactions. I have to. You're going to grind for the cat. Okay. So are we going to go downstairs immediately? Time? Or is it going to be over here again? Oh boy. Oh. The ghost in my house. What the fuck? What is this music? Excuse me, please stop that. Stop that at once. Hello? Down here? Something can definitely happen with that lady. Oh, they heard footsteps. That does not... I don't like that. Is it gonna do a ghost event again? Yes, let's go. Get something. Oh, that's just... Wait, that's not a ghost interaction? It's just something that happens? I'm guessing it's randomized. Because if that would happen every time, it would be kind of silly. Uh... Behind me? I thought I was gonna get an EMF there. It's scripted? Because Han Tracer had a lot of scripted events. But there were so many of them that it really didn't matter. Because you would always see new stuff, even if you already played the game a lot. Although that was one of the major issues that Han Chaser had, though, was the replayability. Like, eventually you would know all the puzzles. Oh. You would know all the puzzles and everything, and then it would be, like... You would just feel like you were playing the same game over and over again. So that's one thing that I hope they look into a little bit more. Because that was definitely one of the major issues with their previous game. And I hope they step it up for this one. I have not detected any ghosts. I should really turn on some lights, huh? Hello? Is it like... Does it have a ghost room and stuff? I'm assuming it does. Are you going to be evil again? <laughs> Laughing? <laughs> Laughing? Hello? Can you hear me? Hello, ghost. Can you hear me? It's It seems to be picking up something. I would like to talk with you, ghost. Can you hear me? Just go up even when I say nothing, though. I don't know if it's actually hearing me. Oh, yeah, this fucked up room again. Which last time it was a lot more active. Maybe this is actually a shade. I don't know. Is there some kind of... No, they're just... No, 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 no. I was just curious. Is there some kind of ghost? Uh, I don't think the ghosts do anything. 
Like, all the ghosts are the same? They magna- oh yeah, the name of the ghost. What was it again? I forget. I can't open this. Okay, I don't know where the hell this- oh. Something moved? Oh, they- EMF5! Let's go immediately! Look at the- the cockroach. What's with the cockroach? <laughs> EMF5? Okay, good shit. Something moved over here. Okay. I'm gonna drop it right here. Oh, that opened. Hello, can you hear me? I'm gonna leave that on the ground. We're gonna get more stuff. This is a good ghost room. Okay. The cockroach does the noise? Really? The last was the ghost name. Yeah, what a weird ghost name. Okay. Uh, fingerprints. I mean, I'm guessing they're gonna show up on doors and maybe light switches. So let's do... So this thing didn't do anything last time, but it was this evidence. So I don't really know what to think of that. Uh, we're gonna grab this because this is time sensitive. And I guess this because it takes a while. And then we could take in the candle. Is candle an objective? It is. Okay, so we have the we have those objectives again. Nice. I don't know why it went white. Why it like get a get a, got a little white light when I went into the basement. Kind of weird. Okay. Oh, we need to go over here. That's not what I wanted to pick up at all. Where's my flashlight? Oh my god, I can't see shit right now. Uh, didn't I have a flashlight over here? Uh-oh. Oh, well, there. Don't do that. Got any ectoplasm for me? Any ectoplasmos? Nothing. I'm gonna leave this all here. We still have two more tools to get. What's this? He's right in that. We only have two tools, right? So we can just... Well, I guess we don't take the candle yet. Or we leave the can- Maybe we leave the candle in there. I don't know how this is gonna work. Like, maybe it's gonna kill- Like, it's gonna make me lose my items if I take it out of the thing. I don't know. Spinning interaction? No, the spinning isn't an interaction. That was my sanity. 87. Okay, good stuff. That's fine. Well, wait, thank you for the 16 months, by the way. At least we got EMF right away. Spear box is easy, because we got that really soon. Seems like EMF is also extremely easy, because we got that instantly. Yeah, I'm curious to see what the dead anima death animation looks like as well. We will definitely see that, don't worry. We're gonna die. Uh, oh. What do we use? This? Spear box, maybe a little bit? Can you hear me? Hello, ghost. Can you hear me? Apparently the ghost can always hear you. It's like open mic for the ghost. I mean, previously you were active over here. Oh, God. <laughs> Fuck you, piece of shit. Is that gonna... Are you gonna talk to me now? Hello? Can I open this room? I cannot. What is that? Is it breaking stuff? Hello? I don't think it's spirit box. It would have already talked to me. How the hell does that thing work? Work. Okay, maybe some fingerprints. So anywhere. Oh, there. Your face. Oh, there you go. Look at that. Easy peasy. You have fingerprints. That's easy. Okay, nice. Two evidence. Maybe some ectoplasm too. What? What are we? What are we looking for? Uh, drawing. Freezing temps. ESG. Ectoplasm, so no spear box. Okay. So we're looking for everything but spear box. Let's go. It just leaves it on walls. Um, I mean, I'm not seeing this. That's a huge hand. He does have a big hand. Oh, and it shows up for a long time. Does it ever even go away? That's extremely obvious. Nice. And on this too. We need to check how obvious fingerprints are because we need to learn how to like rule out evidence in this game and stuff. It's going faster. Was it? it? Sounded like it was going faster there for a second. Maybe. Oh. What the hell? I was just drinking. What was that? Is it closing the door? There's no fingerprints on it though. 
Wish I could turn on my flashlight. I don't think there's a button for it. Uh, I'm hearing all kinds of noises. I'm not seeing this, though. Also, no freezing temps, right? I feel like freezing temps would have been obvious. So I'm going to say no freezing temps. Uh, I need to look for more EMF to figure out where the ghost is right now. Hello? Ghost, can you hear me? It's definitely not in that room because there's no fire, no chair moving and stuff like that. Previously, it was doing stuff here. Giving us EMF. It can do over there because that's on the outside. That's the outside of the map. You would see your breath. Yeah, I would imagine so. Maybe it's originally in the basement. Well, we already went to the basement, though. Where can you even hide? Is there hiding spots? You can't hide in this. I don't do that. I shouldn't be holding this because we already have fingerprints. My sanity is probably fucked up. Yeah, I would love to see some of this. Why does it go so quiet? Is it a shade? It can be, right? Oh. Ghosty pants. How are you? What happens when the entity gets you? You probably die, but I don't know. I've never died because I'm too good at the game. This is a very detailed environment. Like, lots of stuff happening. Stock photo. What are these? Oh, they're just boxes. Hey, why would you make a wall, like, with crucifixes like that? Why? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> a huge piece of shit. There's so many different ones. So many different models, too. Like, why are they all a different one? Is it the ghost just... The house is just super haunted, I guess? Yeah, I'm gonna say it's not this. What do I do? These boxes? Did these move? Oh, God. Hello? This is such a weird device with a comp... Hi there. Okay, maybe we are here. There's this shit here. Okay. I'm gonna say it's probably this, like, not this again. Okay. It's doing stuff here. Anyway, we need to figure out what the ESG is, man. What does it do? Maybe ectoplasm on the wall? Don't see it. Hard to see, though. It's like dots. Like, in what way? Is it like... Is it like sideways? I have to place it in a bottleneck or something? It seems like incredibly hard. You'll see the ghost standing over it? The ghost spawns on top of it. Okay. That hasn't done that at all. Walk around to see if we can... Maybe in the same spot? Not in the same spot. Last time this became fairly obvious. I'm gonna say it's not this again. So then it's just... I'm gonna say it's a poltergeist. But, like, what do I do if it's wrong, though? Am I gonna die? Hello? It's just always that thing. Maybe the spinny wheel? I have no idea what the spinny wheel does. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna leave. I'm just gonna assume it's sp spinny wheel again. It should be... Maybe we gotta turn the light off. I'm just gonna say it's the spinny wheel again. And we're gonna say it's a poltergeist. Uh, I think it is. Am I just insane with this? <laughs> Excuse me. We got it right again. <laughs> what the fuck? So yeah, the, the spinny wheel is by far the hardest evidence to get. Uh, now we have a candle and I can light the candle and now we can get an objective. Get the ghost to blow out a candle. I got 75% sanity. Okay. So let's place this at the ghost. It's definitely PNG fire. Look at my finger. I have my finger in the thing. That must hurt. Uh, I guess I'll place it right here. It says the ghost has been active here. Do just place this and then leave? Do I just sit here do nothing? <laughs> Is that, I'm going to lose the item if I don't bring it back. I hope not. 
Come on, blow out my candle, you fool. I have the light on. Maybe we can still see the thing? Blow out my candle. We gotta hold it, maybe? Oh, it did! It blew it out just now! It made a blue and blowing noise and everything. Okay, I'm out of here. Goodbye. I did it. Made a giggle. Okay, wait, we did... We're, we're slowly getting more... Uh, now we're gonna get even more money, which means we might even be able to buy a photo cam and then we can do another objective. Did we do it? We did do it. All right, completed two. So we can't do the, uh, the exorcism yet because we don't have enough. Okay, well, let's get out of here. And then hopefully it's going to give us like 500 for doing that. Please. How much? 200! Oh, come on. I can't buy the thing. But I did level up to... I got 30 experience, so I leveled up. Uh, okay. I mean, that, please tell me you didn't use my candle. No, I still have the candle. Nice. I put the candle back in. There's a thermometer, so you don't have to see it. Okay. Measure the temperature of the room. You know what? That's actually extremely useful, so we can fit, find the ghost room easier. That might actually be, like, the thing to get. Although, this is also a thing to get. Yeah, obviously ESG. Oh, here, it says it. ESG raises the energy of paranormal entities to display the ghost itself on top of the device. But how the fuck it does that, I have no idea. Okay, um, I mean, you could buy more of them so you can have it faster. I wonder if there's a cap to that. Crucifix. Crucifix is a holy item that will protect you from ghost attacks. $2,000, though? Okay, uh, I think we're gonna, we're gonna go back in so we can get the photo cam. Uh... Maybe we turn it up to medium now. Okay, increased sanity pill restoration, rare light break chance, moderate sanity pill restoration, moderate light break chance, uh, moderate reward multiplier, difficulty game, difficult game ex experience against ghosts. All right, we're doing it. We're going on medium difficulty this time. Let's do it. Oh, wait, I can buy it. I still had some leftover money from last time. I forgot. Let's go. We can buy it. Boom. Nice. Okay. So we have everything now. We have a candle and a photo cap, which means we can do... Wait, you know... Let's do medium. I mean, I'm gonna die and then lose all my money. You know what? Since I... Let's do easy and see if we can do, like, a full exorcism stuff. Like, let's do that. Could we buy a sanity pill as well? How expensive are those? Two thousand? What? Jesus Christ, man. That's crazy. Okay. Now, keep in mind that this is just a demo. Like, I didn't pay for this game. So, again, so the fact that there's only one map right now is because they're going to add more maps in the game you actually buy. Um, so, that's totally fair. My, I didn't take any items. I was just running into the house immediately. Uh, okay, so we have photo cam. Let's obviously start with this. I think I'm not going to take the photo cam in right away. We're going to... I mean, this is the way to go. This thing is extremely good. And... Um, in the spirit box, honestly, both of those worked pretty well early on. We're just gonna stick to those. Why why change a winning team? We can buy the second map? Really? Yeah, the the month the, you do have to pay a lot for stuff in this game. But do keep in mind that you make a thousand bucks from just getting the ghost correct, right? That is a lot of money. <laughs> this is a small map. And I've already gotten it correct twice. So it is definitely doable. Hello? Shop screen, the second map is 8,000. Jesus. Okay, that's very expensive. Why did they give you basically the full game for the demo? That seems kind of weird. Why would you do that? <laughs> what's their What's their plan here? <laughs> like, I guess they're... Oh, I think I know. The, isn't the demo... Ex oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Isn't the demo extremely limited? Like, once the game comes out, it's gonna be gone? The devs said in the current Discord server, there's only one map currently for the demo that will release the game with three playable maps. Okay, I see. I see. Cool. It's for Steam Fest. I see. Play it now. Rainbow, thank you for the sub. How many people are working on this game again? I definitely hope they do return to Haunt Chaser at some point, because I really enjoyed Haunt Chaser. I thought that was a great game. They're definitely a more unique game than this. Like, this is obviously very heavily inspired by Phasmo. I don't think they are returning to it. Damn, that's a shame. But it's 
I mean, you gotta pay the bills. I can understand. Oh, nothing is happening. I'm just gonna turn on all the lights. Oh, maybe in the basement. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fuck you. You can blow a fuse with too many lights. Fuck. Fuck. This is such a weird EMF, man. I do like that it's not just... Oh, here we go. It's a basement ghost. Oh, no. That's cursed. Don't do that to me, man. Hello? Can you hear me? Spirit, can you speak? EMF 4? That's probably gonna be an EMF 5 later. In here. Hello? I can hear breathing here. Anyone here? Anyone? Okay, I'm getting some more stuff, man. I don't like this. Wait, this is kind of hard now, though, because I have... Oh, it's dark. It's, d it's dark. When you have no light, it is fucking dark. Okay, this is not even... Oh, my God. What the fuck? It's the darkest game of all time. You need to have a light. Oh, God. Do this thing as well. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Was that in the spirit box? Hello? Can you hear me? Spirit, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Ghost. Do you want to talk? Oh! Oh. You got spirit box? It says I want to talk to you? What do you want to... Uh, how do you feel today? Hello? You want to play a game? Okay, well, at least it's Spirit Box. That's extremely easy then. Spirit Box? Doesn't seem like it's that. I have to keep my light or, or my flashlight on me because I cannot see. Okay. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Let's go. So it's obviously going to be a one to four player co-op horror game, by the way. Like every single ghost game. Some ghost games have more players, but I really think four is the sweet spot. I think, I think like Ghost Exile and Ghost Hunters Core you can do with up to six, but it seems kind of chaotic at that point. Like, what? Do you, no one's going to know what's going on. It's just going to be complete chaos. I'm going to put this in here. Maybe we're finally going to get this. It looks definitely amazing. Like, the lighting is very well done. I wish they would increase the resolution for this tiny thing a little bit, because it is potato graphics. Any ectoplasm? So now it, it turns on a light down here. Ectoplasm immediately. Okay, so that's easy too. There you go. Okay. Ectoplasm. I'm gonna put that in the middle of the cursed thing. That's probably gonna work, right? I'm probably gonna say it's not EMF 5, given that we've gotten so much EMF. Oh, it can't be EMF 5. There. Oh. Okay, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Bye. Doing stuff. That ectoplasm, it's white on the wall. It's like a little white stain on the wall. Okay, what are we looking for? I need to leave first before I look. <clears throat> You're looking for ESG, freezing temps, or easel drawing. Okay, so fingerprints is impossible, so we don't even have to take the light. Okay, good stuff. But I can't complete the objectives yet, so there's really no point in taking them now. Unless you can complete them early, but it says clearly you have to finish the rest first. We're just gonna have to use this. Uh, we're at 85. Okay, we're, we'll, we'll be all right. I hope this thing is finally gonna show me something. Please don't be this thing. That's what I'm asking. Like, don't make me guess again. Because I'm people are gonna think I'm just lucky. But I'm actually a genius. <laughs> 
Yeah, I think that I think so so far. I mean, obviously we've only played two games. This is our third game. Um they should Oh, wait, what? Oh, it just changes color when you down here cuz it's also the glass changes. Um So the the events are a little scripted. Like, let's go here again. Is it going to do the exact same thing again? Okay, it's not all it doesn't always happen, but it seems like they always have It's kind of the Ghost Watchers effect. Where if you play Ghost Watchers, which I think these games definitely work, like Ghost Watchers was probably one of the most successful ghost hunting games besides Phasmo and Ghost Hunters Core, uh, because it was so flashy. However, from a perspective of someone who plays ghost hunting games like a lot, I think Ghost Watchers is an extremely shallow game with very little game, like very little uh, substance to the ghost events like most of the ghost events are just a ghost like doing some scripted interaction that gets extremely old after you've seen it for the 70th time uh and i kind of see that same thing happening here where you're like oh i walk over here oh it's gonna do the break the neck event oh my god it's like uh it's kind of i can see that getting pretty still soon any light down here so they definitely should um should be careful about that. I think Ghost Watchers is still being worked on. I constantly... I'm in the Ghost Watchers Discord. I constantly get pings about them asking for... Which is fair. Like, it's just... It's a thing. Like, indie devs don't necessarily make a lot of money. But I constantly see uh, posts in their Discord of them wanting to... Like, can someone translate the entire game for us for free? <laughs> it's like... I mean, yeah, okay, I guess. <laughs> I mean, if people want to do that, that's totally fine. But I keep getting pings about that. It's like, I mean, if they didn't respond to it the first time, I don't know. Oh, the, 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 the bing dong? Hello there. What's that? Oh, that was the ESG! Wait, that was the ESG! Was it? Was that what it looks like? Let's go! We did it! It's a spirit again. I'm, I got it. Let's go. <laughs> nice. Okay. It's like a T-pose model right above it. That's super short. Okay. Good stuff. Let's get the hell out of here. Go, go, go. Now we can do more objectives. But how are we going to take a ghost photo? I guess we just take a ghost photo of any interaction. Planning to play Hogwarts Legacy? No, definitely not. Photo cam? Yes, we need to take a photo. And we need to get the candle. But the candle is super easy. Can we do everything now? Wait a minute. How the fuck are we supposed to do this, though? Take a solid photo of the ghost. Have the ghost blow... So it's always the same objectives. I'm guessing they're going to add more objectives in the full game. Um, take a photo of the ghost. Have the ghost blow out a candle. And find sitting human silhouette using the ectoplasm glass. What the fuck does that even mean? Is the cat going to follow you around? That's a really important question. Yeah, I mean, I so they do give some kind like the ghost part. If we, I saw a question in chat about that, they give like uh, you you get into you get into the credits, which is I mean, I definitely don't think like translating is like as big of a deal because like people like to have the game in their language, right? So they don't mind translating it. It's just that literally instead of like every time I get a ping, I go to the Ghost Watchers Discord to see oh is there a new update and it's like. We still need people for these languages. And I'm like, okay, the last three pings were about the exact same. I was hoping there was going to be a new update. Um, <laughs> Hello? Oh, God. I did not mean to do that. Uh-oh. Okay, wait. Do I walk over here and then take a photo of this thing that's going to happen here? Does that count? I don't know if that counts. Probably doesn't. Probably you have to take the photo during a hunt. Ghost events do not count. Okay, that's kind of... Maybe the ESG, though? Or not. Okay, the candle's in the ghost room. That's fine. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. Not ESG either. Okay, that's extremely difficult. How the fuck are we supposed to find... So we're supposed to find a ghost sitting in a chair? How does that look like? Oh, it's doing stuff. What, you just, you'll know it when you see it? Okay. Because I want to exercise the ghost if we can. Uh, we walk around. 
There's no ghost. Do we just... Is it anywhere or is it where the ghost is? Oh, it's just... It's somewhere on a chair. It's like... Oh, you have to find the specific chair. Oh, okay. I see. So it's got... It's like the bone or what now? It's anywhere, but is it always there? Or is it a random event? It's random. Okay, fuck. Um. Oh. Hello. I don't see anything. Yeah, you gotta search the whole place, I guess. I mean, there's. Uh, what the fuck? That was sick. What the hell? <laughs> that was so cool. I can't even go into this room. Hey, that was cool. Hooked ya. Oh, there you go! Aha! What do I do with that? What do I do with that? I found it! Did that finish the objective immediately? Do I take a photo? That's it, done? Okay. I see. Okay, so you just have to find that thing? Alright, that makes a lot of sense. Uh, did we do the- did we do that objective? Let me quickly see. So then all we gotta do is survive a hunt now, which- and take a photo during- It's the only time you can take a photo during a hunt, because that's gonna be fucked up. I'm gonna die for sure, and then lose all my items and cry. No, you can take it. I did do both of them, okay, okay. So we just need to take a solid photo of the ghost, and then we can exercise it? Exercise the ghost. Find Sarah Miller's three, five missing fingers and place them in the ritual area in the basement. Okay. I guess you can't get those fingers before the, the ritual starts. It shows itself randomly? Really? Sometimes it walks near me? I've never seen that. Okay. Okay. Let's try. I guess we're going to be close in the ghost room. We could do it during, uh... During a uh, hunt as well, though, right? That should work. I, s I already saw a finger before, though. That's the thing. I saw a finger in an envelope near a door, unless that was just a random prop and the real finger spawned later. Oh, God. It's so dark down here. All right, do something. I it's doing all kinds of stuff. Hello? Oh, lights are turning on? Man, that's cool, man. I said it's gonna go f fine. I mean, I'm still playing on easy, right? Please don't kill me. <laughs> oh, boy. Please. Please, I'm nice. I'm a nice boy. I'm a friendly, friendly ghost hunter. Please? It shows itself at the start of a hunt. I think. I think I need a hunt. Let's do a hunt and I'm gonna run away. Come on. We're gonna die. Hello? What was that? It just rolled something? Every time I think it's a. Oh, hi there. You are not showing yourself, but you're doing lots of stuff. I appreciate it. It's cool. But I would love for you to actually do something. You can loop in. Yeah, yeah, you can loop. I did it! I did it! Get the fuck out of here! It made a giggle. It did, what would you guys said? Okay, I did it. I did it. I did it. Get the hell out of here. Let's go. Okay, okay, okay. Go through the truck. I want to read it. Nice. We're doing it. <laughs> and you die. Absolutely. Okay. Hey, one-handed, what's up? Yeah, I'm so slow right now. So we've done everything. Here we go. The exercise the ghost, find Sarah Miller's five missing fingers, and place them in the ritual area in the basement. So we did do everything. Uh, are the fingers going to show up in this stuff or something? Or do I just... I guess I just find them. It's fingies? Wait, what's my sanity? It's real fucked up, probably. I wish I had a sanity pill. Did I see Victoria room? I don't know what that is. Uh, my sanity is 52. Uh-oh, it's gonna hunt soon. Fuck me. 
See with the, my eyes and they glow? Okay. Aquasora, thank you for the 17 months. Okay. We just look around the map everywhere. Okay. Um. They glow. This girl is still sitting there, still chilling. Where are they? Do candles prevent your sanity from draining? I should check the basement first, because that's going to be a scary area once the ghost starts hunting more. Oh boy. Oh, da 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 What the fuck? Any fingies? I don't see any fingies. Fuck me, man. Get me out of here. There's a room in the bedroom with a dress. You have to say Victoria to come in? Really? Uh, let's try that. Oh, I heard a candle be blown out. I picked up the candle, I'm stupid. Where the fuck are the fingers? They're supposed to be glowing, right? People said. Oh, they're not glowing! Oh, they're... Oh, what the fuck? They are, like, slightly glowing. Not much. Okay. Well, fuck me. That's gonna be hard. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, that's fine. That's fine or whatever. The spooky place. It's gonna be hard to find those fingers. There's one in here, right? Look, there's a finger in there. Well, there's a finger. Oh, but you need to have an inventory space? That's so fucked up. You suck. Victoria! That's cool. <laughs> That's cool, man. Oh, hi there. So yeah, there's. If you weren't convinced there's voice recognition in this game, that should convince you. <laughs> yeah, but there's nothing in here. Uh, any more fingies down here? Are we. I mean, we're gonna have to check. Let's just drop off the fingers. Oh man, this is gonna suck. It's gonna hunt. One more hidden? Okay, go more. One second, I need to drop off the fingers. I'm gonna drop off the fingers and then I go back there. That's cool. Oh god, what the fuck? Help! That was terrifying, he was coming up the stairs. Oh god, he's walking! Oh no. is going on and i leave okay he's done jesus christ that scared the hell out of me is a hunt the fuck is happening i'm gonna die i'm gonna pass away i'm gonna perish okay place the damn okay go 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 the hunt We did something. Any f oh, a finger? Nice. Okay, another one. Okay, I'm gonna place this one. Hopefully, the ghost won't be coming up here. And then we need to only find two more. Oh. There might be one down there in the basement, though. It's a moon. Thank you for the nine months. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. They do kind of glow. But they're... They glow in white. For some reason, I thought they were going to be, like, blue or a different color. All right, this could be my end here, because I'm running into a dead-end area, right? Oh, no. There's something back here, then? We already found a finger in here, didn't we? We did. Here we go. I broke that light. Please don't tell me he's coming down this hallway. I check over here. There's definitely gonna be a finger in this cursed ass room, right? No. No fingies. You peas. They oh, we can say Magna here. Magna? Magna. Magna? How do you say that? Magna? Isn't that how you say? Oh, Jesus Christ! Is that what I did? Magna. Magna. Is that what I did? 
Did you guys just make me jump scare myself? Pieces of shit. Is that it? Is that the secret? Or is there something in here? Where the fuck are these? Good. I just got trolled. Go into the picture? Can I do that? No. Magna! I think that was it. Because there's nothing behind this one. Okay, where the fu- Oh no, is that a hunt? Where the fuck are the last... In the Victoria room? What the, what the fuck? This is a cockroach! Oh! <laughs> you beat that, dude. Woo! Okie dokie then. Oh, there was someone on the cam. What the hell was this? Nightmare, dream, dream, and nightmare? What the hell am I looking at? Oh. Fuck. Oh, I'm about to be jump scared, huh? Oh my god! <laughs> you suck. Open this door. What the fuck is that picture? That's so cursed. Ah, oh, hi there. That is so cursed. Can I open this door? What the hell? Is the dream door not possible? Harry Potter style photos. Don't know. Where the fuck are the last fingers gonna be? We still need oh, there's one! Oh, baby, we just need one more. It's gotta be in the basement, right? 100%. 100% we have a basement finger. That's the last one. Unless it's in here somehow. Could it be basement? It's gotta be, right? But that sucks for us, because that's where the ghost is. Oh god, here we go. Is this the haunting noise? Hello? You can't be on the floor? Yeah, I just found one on the floor. Come on, where the fuck is the final finger? Don't make me go into the basement. I don't want to do this. I don't want to. But I think I have to. Here we go. Oh, what the fuck? That's fake. Okay, it's fake. It's fake. It's fake. Isn't there a picture with writing in the hallway? What? Oh, yeah, yeah, but what does that do? It's just like play with me or something. Hunting, 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 hunting. Okay, but that's good. That's probably gonna have a cooldown. Ah! What the fuck? My brother in Christ! Ah! No, no! so fucking fast! How did he get so fast, dude? <laughs> How did he get so fast? What the fuck? He came out of nowhere. <laughs> okay. Dude, that is hard with the photos or with the fingers. Man, we were so close. Oh, but you still got the money for doing the objectives and you get a payback? Wait, that was actually not that bad. Wait, you still get money for finishing it. You just get half the money. Okay. Wait, we can actually buy, like, basically everything back that we lost? Because all we lost... I mean, we can't... No, we can! Because we lost a candle and a photo cam. Boom! We have it all back. <laughs> Let's go. We didn't lose any... Well, we did... I think we only lost $200 there, so that wasn't even that bad. Okay. Uh, so let's go... We gotta be able to exercise. Come on. We can do that. That was terrifying, man. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, here we go. Uh, every... Oh, I need to put it in. Put that in. Put that in. I want to do a full-on exorcism. I'm gonna go back in on easy because otherwise, I don't think we can do it. Buy a safe house? No, no, no. I wanna, I wanna just beat the game. Here we go. Well, we'll get to buy a cat in the full game. Don't worry. And then, because those worked instantly. You had the naked NPC glitch yet? That sounds terrifying. As a streamer, that is like the biggest jump scare I could ever have. Or like some hanging body. That's even scarier. 
or someone saying the the forbidden S word. Oh god, I should hold this out. Do painting in the hallway. What do you what do I do with the painting in the hallway? Do you want to play with me? Do you want to play tag with me? Do you want to play ball with me? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell, dude? <laughs> That's cool. I like those. I like that stuff. Like having little secrets this is something I've never seen in a game like this before. So that's really cool. I mean, it's definitely something that is like more for, oh God, more for a first time playthrough. But look at this, Victoria. <laughs> that is cool. That's like fun. Oh God, don't be in the basement again, please. Don't laugh at me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, what the fuck? Ghost here? This is where the thermal would come in handy, probably. Come on. And we were, look at look. You can look for fingers. No, they spawn when you go to the exorcism phase, right? Or do they not? I'm pretty sure they spawn at the end of the game. I don't think they're they're there yet at the beginning. And that was hard though to loop them there. I mean, I did it before. There's no ghost on here. That's good though that there's no ghost in here. Because as long as you're far away from the ghost, you don't really get found. But where the hell is the ghost? What does the insect do? It's detecting EMF. I don't really know, honestly. That looks like it's out of place. Doesn't it? Yep. M4. Okay. Can you hear me? Do you want to talk? Can you hear me? Where are you? Spirit, can you speak? Can you hear me? Where are you? I'm basically going to say it's instantly not spear boxes that showed up like right away last time. And we can now drop our flashlight because we're in the in the easy place. So we can bring our equipment much faster. The insect is running for its life. What's our bug name? You guys can make up a name. It moves when I move? I don't know. Like I don't know if this is based on some kind of device or if it's just supposed to be creepy. And weird. Philip, <laughs> Jimmy, Jimmy the Jimmy the cro the cockroach, Winston. Oh no, that's dark. Show me some ecto. Ecto on the wall, right away. No ecto on the wall. Maybe immediate fingerprints on light switch. Throw something through that. Get EMA 5. EMA 5. Nice. Let's go. All right. EMA 5. Easy peasy. Good shit. It turned on this light, but there's no thingy. I don't know if that's going to show up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It, is a little, it has like the Phasmo problem where you have to go in and out a bunch to get... Um, Uh, to get the the equipment. And we do this one. And I guess we already take this because we know everything that we're going to... Because it's going to be the same thing again, right? It's going to be take a saw. Yeah, yeah, it's always the same. So the objectives are sort of, as of now are extremely easy. Well, not easy, but they're like the same every time. The roach is called CJ. What the heck? Awkward cookie, thank you for the three months. Wish you could get this early. I hope I don't know if the the candle prevents your sanity from draining.
Okay. Oh, it immediately did it. Holy shit. Okay, then. <laughs> that was crazy. Well, that works. Okay, maybe it's easier than I thought. What are we looking for? We're looking for fingerprints, not in drawing. Looking for fingerprints, ectoplasm stains, and freezing. It, it blew on a candle. That's not how that works, you silly goober. You silly goober. Any ectoplasm? No ectoplasm. Lighting the fire. Are there gonna be fingerprints around here? Can you please touch the light switch so I can see fingerprints? I need that. I do wish you could... Like, it also feels a little contrived that you have to do it in this specific order, right? Where it's like, uh... You have to first get the ghost for sure. Like, imagine if Phasma worked that way, it would be so tedious. Like. The bone only spawns after you have completed the entire game and you're gonna have to like end the game by going around the whole building again to find the fucking bone. That could be like a, a custom difficulty modifier, like the sequential game. You have to play it in, in a specific order. It would be nice if you could already do some objectives in the meantime. So you had something to focus on. Um, drop the painting. Not seeing any ectoplasm, which was really obvious last time. It's also not... F it's probably fingerprints. Oh, hi there. It's probably fingies? Because I would think that it would have already showed that on the wall there. The ecto is so hard to see. No, I mean, if you know where it shows up, it's fine. I don't think it's ecto. I think it's fingerprints. But you can get it wrong and still exercise the ghost, maybe? Drawing can take a while, but it can't be drawing this time. Because that's not, not even an option. Not even an option. Yeah, I saw lots of people request this game in the comments as well. Seems like people knew, knew about it before I did. Like, I knew the Haunt Chaser devs were working on something. Okay, um... I don't know. Yeah. Oh, I don't think it is. I think it's just finger fingerprints. This is the one evidence that it needs to do something for. Because it's not, it's not ectoplasm. It's definitely not freezing. It's definitely not ectoplasm. So it's got to be a poltergeist again. I'm going for it. There you go. We did it. Okay, nice. So it was that. I'm I'm a genius. I'm a gamer. Okay, just turn off the no. Turn off the light switch, which means there's gonna be fingerprints. Anyway, we need to take a photo now. Giggle for me. Or do we find this girl again? Oh boy, she's gonna be anywhere. Yo 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 Kind of a shitty ghost room though. I mean, we can kind we can get far. Oh, there you go. Nice, we found her. Okay, good stuff. So now we just need to take a photo. We have more sanity this time because we did it a lot quicker than before. Stop breaking my lights, you piece. Okay. We just need to take a ghost photo. Come on. Game is tough. It is definitely... I mean, I don't know. So it doesn't feel based off skill. Oh. The fuck, it's clipping into that. Because it doesn't really feel like my skill impacts a lot of the stuff that's happening. Which... That's one of the things that can make Phasma sometimes extremely annoying. I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, we have the fingerprints now. Wait, we did it. Let's go. What can make Phasma sometimes extremely annoying is that you just have to like, um, wait for stuff to happen, right? You have to wait for um, the ghost event objectives and stuff like that. That's why they're optional objectives, right? And something like the cursed possession was really important because it allowed us to 
uh, force stuff to happen. Okay, we got two fingers already immediately. I think I think what this like if I if I see myself play this game a lot, I can see the waiting can be become slightly tedious. Because uh, I think, for example, something like uh, This Is A Ghost has done a really good... Because uh, in This Is A Ghost, you also have to wait a lot for the stuff to show up. However, what they have in that game is that there's so much to do outside of the waiting that uh, like, it doesn't feel like you're waiting because you can always just like, okay, I'm waiting for this now. Let me do that. Like You always can divert your attention to do something else. Um... Okay, there's no fingerprint a finger down here. Uh, to be fair, how do you make a game need skill outside of such things as precision? Well, like having a having some kind of risk reward systems like the Phasmo Curse Possession or the motion sensors and this is a ghost, which really really accurately allow you to find the ghost so you can use your other tools on them. Uh like having the ability to start sprinting and this is a ghost to create the to make the ghost more active and make it hunt so you can get other evidences like there is really a lot of ways you can make ghost hunting games uh like make the pr player proactive in ghost hunting games you really don't have to make them uh like reactive instead of like giving the player agency like there's many ways uh okay i we should check around is it could it be in this area by the way the fingerprints, or is this like a bonus area? Not sure. Dream? Can I open this? I can't. I don't know. It's. Oh, now it opens. The Shivers wishlist now on Steam. There you go. Okay. The dream. Oh boy, we gotta go fast. We gotta go faster. Oh wait, we got uh, three fingers, right? So we need two more. Not seeing any over here, which is bad because there was also none in the basement. Oh, wait, Magna? I gonna do the ghost the jump scare again? Magna, Magna, blah blah blah. Peace. You're not doing anything. Goodbye. Seven pillars of folly. Thank you for the four months. It's gotta be in the entrance, right? The entrance area. Didn't I already got one here? Oh, there's one. Okay. One more. Wait, let's just deliver these because there's no other choice. <clears throat> and then we need to find one more. Oh, God. That's fine. It's just a ghost. NB, thank you for the prime. Oh, my God. Okay. And let's make sure that it's not down here. You would expect one to be into the basement. No, it seems like there just are no finger spawns in here. At least not right now. Oh, am I gonna die when I go up? I said there was one more in the workshop. Oh no. Um. Oh boy. Come on, one more. One more, and we do it. You piece of garbage. Go to the workshop hallway, maybe. Maybe like on the ground in the hallway. Check the workshop first. That is not a finger. That is just a thing. That is just a whatever sardines. <laughs> no. It just I can see the mistake though. Uh yeah, there's nothing. Nothing. To the left. What? Basement floor left corner. I was doing a ghost hunt. Don't do it, man. Maybe something over here. Just give me the last one. This is kind of like a... Oh, there! Let's go! This is kind of Ghost Watcher-ish, where you have to, like, find shit around the map to exercise the ghost. Like, I think... I think that has been attempted a lot. Oh, no. That was just a ghost event. That has been attempted a lot ever since 
Phasmo, but I really think it's never improved the gameplay significantly. Like, be basically requiring you to find a bunch of bones really doesn't add much, but here we go. Oh. We did it. Get fucked? Are you dead? Did I do it? Easy peasy? Let me go back to the truck. So as I was saying, like the gameplay where you constantly have to find stuff on in the map or you have to wait for things. Like I, as, I, as I can see this game right now, they definitely have some problems to solve. Like the waiting for the ghost photo. I mean, I see that can be fine as long as it can happen during the investigation phase as well. Like it really is unnecessary for to force the player to do it in a specific order because it just means that there's always going to be a bunch of waiting every game instead of so because in phasmo as well some yeah we did it in phasmo some games you're going to be waiting whereas a lot of the games you'll just like instantly complete everything and that's going to feel pretty exhausting i think if there's never going to be a time where you don't have to wait during a game it's going to feel fairly exhausting to play the game over a long period of time. But there you go. We did everything. How much is the exorcism going to give us? It better give us another thousand. I swear to God. Are you getting me only 600? Wait. Oh, I got the ghost wrong. Wait, what? Wait. Huh? What was Obake? Wait, I'm stupid? Okay, at least we got 600. Wait, what's Obake? What was for Obake? The evidence? I don't know what the evidence was for Obake, but I guess it wasn't fingerprints. Maybe it was... It wasn't freezing temps. It probably was like ectoplasm i guess i just didn't look for long enough but anyway that is uh remember the demo of the shivers which i definitely think this game has promised i really like the equipment i like the way the game looks it looks very good uh that i like the safe house building i think that's something we are severely lacking in phasmo like i genuinely don't understand like you can't buy another map or you can buy something here like being able to buy uh, like the, the that's why I got took such a liking to this as a ghost immediately because it gave me something that I was severely lacking in every ghost in the game up till then. It gave me a good progression curve, like a, a curve where you actually like there's a lot to learn. The skill ceiling is super high, and there is uh, like a lot of stuff you can spend your money on. Because ultimately, I think the reason why for me Phasmo still remains so fun even without all of that is because the skill ceiling in Phasmo is like freaking up into the stratosphere because there's so much to learn about every ghost and even though i already know like everything about every ghost it's fun to put it to practice and show it to other people so in this game i think i miss a skill ceiling like i miss some kind of way you can use skill to increase your 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 results i miss uh like i think the the ghost events can feel can start to feel kind of uh scripted because they already kind of started feeling that and i have only played four games so uh, that's, that's like kind of a concern, uh, which was the same for Han Chaser as well. And then, uh, the finding of the fingers feels kind of a little lame. If I'm honest, like, it's just, you find five things and then you win. It's like finding five bones and that's like the way you win the game. Like I'd much rather do something like this as a ghost where you shoot the ghost or like ghost, wa ghost, uh, ghost watchers where you have to do some kind of ritual, which is also kind of similar. In Ghost Watchers, you also have to run around and find a lot of stuff, which I find kind of annoying. I think the two games with exorcisms that are the best, in my opinion, is This is a Ghost, well, the three games. This is a Ghost, Metaphysical, and uh, Ghost Hunter Score, which Ghost Hunter Score was one of the first ever Ghost Hunter games. So those three, honestly, have have the best exorcism mechanics in my opinion very different exorcism mechanics but I, I like them but anyway that is this game i would love to hear your opinion uh definitely check out the demo it's completely free there's no reason uh if, if you like this and you just want to check it out for yourself you can do that for free uh, and i hope you enjoyed uh, i'm definitely going to be playing out the uh, playing the full game when it comes out uh, i wonder what they're going to do with it and i hope to see more maps and stuff because we only have one map right now although we do have the pub i think the pub is not a map it's like a location anyway thank you so much uh, if you enjoyed the video, if you're or if you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the lovely gamers here in chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv slash insim. Or click the link in the description down below. And if you are curious about a bunch of unknown ghost hunting games to see if there's any that strike your fancy, I have a whole playlist of unknown ghost hunting games uh, that you can find over in the top right. Uh, I, I definitely recommend, for example, This is a Ghost if you've never played it. Metaphysical was lots of fun. And obviously Phasmo if you haven't played it already. But anyway, I'll see you around. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye. <laughs> Alrighty.